welcome to our channel. My name is Mary Keorg, immigration lawyer. Today I'm making this video on a service at our office that we call Tips and Guidelines Review Session. It's a service that we've been offering for the last two years about to clients that don't necessarily want or need to hire a lawyer to prepare their immigration applications. Um, so they, don't need, they might not need representation to get a list of documents, to prepare a cover letter, to review the forms, to prepare the forms with them, to have a lawyer on file that's going to communicate with immigration back and forth, either because um, they feel very, very confident that uh, they can do it themselves, or they've been through various immigration applications and they know how the system works, or um, they've talked to friends or people in the community, or maybe even done a few consultations with some rep legal representatives, and uh, they feel they are able to tackle it by themselves. Um, so what we do for these types of clients, if they, um, if they often, we often get clients who call and say, well, can you, can I prepare my application? I'll do everything and can you file it or can you review it? So what we've done is we prepared this service. Um, basically you have to prepare your entire application. Um, so you would prepare everything from A to Z. You would do all the forms, you would collect all the documentation. And what we tell you is when you are ready, when you have everything ready, you can scan it to us in the entire package. You can hire our services just for this review session, which is basically a special hourly rate. Usually it's about an hour, an hour and a half. And we get uh, on the phone with you or we get on a, on a video call with you and we essentially review your entire application and we give you tips and guidelines to enhance your application, things that we see right away that need to be corrected, and just some ideas on how to make your application more complete. What's important to know about these this tips and guidelines session is that we will not be the lawyer on the file. So we will not be filing your application on your behalf. We won't be um, reviewing your entire application before we get on the call and send you information beforehand. Afterwards, we're not going to answer a um, multitude of questions about how you know little things that you still want to complete just because at that point it becomes more of a lawyer client uh, relationship so it's just really for people who have completed everything and they just want a specialized uh, person a legal representative an immigration lawyer to look at the file and say okay can you please tell me if, if this is all uh, correct or, or where, what do you think so in the beginning when we launched this service uh, we got a, a couple of uh, inquiries and then we realized that after some time when we were advertising it that people are actually really, really interested in this. So, of course, we still get most of our clients, our, our clients who hire us uh, as their legal representative because uh, we handle a lot of complex and complicated cases. Um, but we do have clients who they're just not sure about a few things and they still want the lawyer to, to look at it. So it's been um, it's been a service that we've been doing more and more and we actually... Uh, we love doing this because legal fees can sometimes be quite expensive depending on, on the type of file that we have to handle, the number of hours that we have to do. And some people, they, they don't need a lawyer, they don't need to hire a lawyer um, to work for, for, for them uh, on the entire file, but they just want to make sure that what they did is correct. And as experienced uh, immigration lawyers, we have submitted hundreds and hundreds of applications. So when we get a a file that's prepared by you and most likely your file is a pretty straightforward file so it could be a spousal sponsorship that has no criminality no previous refusal it could be um, visitor visa we've done a lot of those where there's a there's a travel history and uh, there's good tie to the home country it's a straightforward file it could be a simple visitor extension we call it simple but for some reason people it might still be a little bit complicated but if you are someone that read online and you're like, okay, you know what, I have all this information, let me just prepare a visitor extension. Um, it could be either be even be a super visa, it could be a parental sponsorship application. So obviously this type of service is really for applications that are more straightforward. And by that I mean, for example, for a humanitarian compassion application, we, we don't really, we haven't done, we haven't had the inquiry really. Um, it wouldn't really work for hearings. Uh, it wouldn't really work for, for example, a spousal sponsorship with uh, misrepresentation or criminality. So it's really for uh, applications that are more or less um, no surprises and uh, no previous uh, multifaceted issues. Um, so what we do, like I said, we, you, you give to us the entire, everything has to be completely ready so that when we get on the call with you, if you're missing things, it's, it's hard for us to give you a global approach. So you would scan everything to us, we get on the phone, 
and we go page by page with you and when we scan through uh, because we filed so many applications it's uh, for example for me if I review a spousal sponsorship seven immigration forms it'll take me not very long to really go through it browse through it and my eye will be able to catch exactly what's missing or exactly what might be wrong uh, just because I've done it over 10 years for over 10 years now on a daily basis so I'll go through the forms we'll go through the forms with you and then we'll look at your supporting documentation and then what we do is uh, we recommend that you prepare a list of questions and then you'll be able to ask us all the questions that you want is this form correct should I include more documentation how long is the process going to take how should I send this in should I send it by FedEx should I send it by regular mail where do I check updates later on um, so we give you all that information uh, and at the end, um, we advise you that if there's any issues in the future, because we're going to already be familiar with your file, you can choose to, to call us um, and hire us later if you want. So I find that this is a service that um, I know that a lot, not a lot of lawyers offer this service, but I feel that in order to have uh, better access to justice, better access to, to legal information, um, one does not need to necessarily uh, hire a lawyer from A to Z, but we can, as lawyers, provide this in-between service, which could be really, really helpful um, for a lot of people out there. So if you are someone that, you know, are about to submit an application, you've prepared everything, but you just want to fine tune certain things, um, you just want to make sure that, you know, everything is, is correct and complete and maybe there's something that could enhance your application, uh, we're happy to provide this service. Obviously, we give you a paperwork um, before that kind of explain the process and we advise you that what we're giving you is recommendation. It's not legal advice in the sense that you can't take that information and if you file your application and something happens uh, we're not responsible because we're not the one who filed your applications for you so we didn't sign off on the documentation um, so that we make it very clear um, and we advise you that you know this this is tips based on our experiences and you can look at our credentials um, by looking up our information you can look at all the blogs we've written you can look up all our youtube videos and this will allow you to kind of complete your application. If there's something that we say that you don't necessarily agree with, then, then you can choose to say, you know what, I'm, I'm going to take this information, but I'm not really uh, going to include it. So we make sure we advise you of that so that there's no misunderstanding that, oh, I spoke to this lawyer, I filed it, but then uh, something happened, but, but they told me this information. So we're very, very upfront from the beginning. And uh, we make sure to advise that the, it's essentially a, a bit of a longer consultation. And we advise you that, of course, the, the the conversation is completely confidential and the conversation does not, um, it won't become a lawyer-client relationship. Um, so we make sure that everything is clear in the beginning um, and then we're able to offer this service. And it's actually something that uh, myself and my team really, really enjoy doing uh, in the office. Um, so if you're interested in this service, please don't hesitate to contact us.